the full first team pre-season friendly and the biggest to date. Three and a half weeks to go till the big kickoff, and we welcome a Charlton side to Longmead. For Tunbridge, four new signings in the starting 11. Lyons, Foster, Higgs, Powell and Bochy. Critchlow gets his first pre-season action since injury. And something else making its debut for Tunbridge today, the Mint Away kit. Now for Charlton, Ryan Vigors is in their side. Lone spell at Maidstone last season. Danny Kedwell's son, Harvey Kedwell. Danny Kedwell had a spell playing with Tunbridge 20 years ago. And Jeremy Santos is the main attraction, a huge hit on his loan spell last season. Ruben Suarez Jr. gets an early shot in. Well saved there from the trialist goalkeeper for Charlton. The Addicts trying to go forward. They've given the ball away though to Jamie Fielding. Nice ball from him in towards Joe Bochy. Gets a nice ball out to Nathan Wood on the left-hand side. Can Wood keep it in play? Yes, he can. Good play there by Wood. Can he get past his man? He can. Challenge goes in. It still runs though for Joel Powell, a former chart player. He'll be looking to impress today. Gets it back there to Bochi. Inside the area. Wood back to Bochi. Nice little play from him. Lovely play. Tommy Fagg. Great block there from the number three, Jacob Roddy. But Tunbridge coming so close to scoring. Tommy Fagg again in the centre circle. Gets the ball out wide to the right hand side. Ruben Suarez Jr. Running at the fullback, Roddy. Can he get his cross in? He can. It's a low ball in. What a lovely goal, Joe Bochi. Great play from Ruben Suarez Jr. right hand side. And Bochi with his back to goal. Death touch. Beats the goalkeeper at the near post. It's 1 0. Ruben Suarez Jr. looking very lively in these early exchanges. Gets a lovely low ball in. Oh, little cheeky back heel there from Joe Bochi. Opens his account in pre season. Higgs, short ball then to Tommy Fagg. Jamie Fielding, just inside his own half. Long ball forward, looking for Joel Powell. Gets into space on the right-hand side, trying to get it past Kedwell. Ruben Suarez Jr. Here's Tommy Fagg. Lively start for him, only just over. I wonder if the goalkeeper would have had that covered. It didn't quite dip early enough. But Tommy Fagg has made a very good start to this game. Long time since I've heard an atmosphere like this in a pre-season friendly. The singing has not stopped. Oh, trying to get it away. Ruben Suarez Jr. inside the area. Is this going to be two across the face of goal? Only just wide. Worth an effort. He's playing with confidence in this pre-season so far. Well, Charlton haven't gone forward much in this half, but there's Kedwell with a long-range effort. And the goalkeeper, Johnny Henley, diving to his right to keep that out. Well, who fancies this free kick? Bochy might fancy it left-footed. Nathan Wood fancies it right-footed. Well, dinked over the wall and to the keeper, and that's the half-time whistle. And Tunbridge leading by a goal to nil at the break, but a strong first-half display. Raft of substitutions of this Charlton side in the second half. Seven, I think it is. They play it down the right-hand side. This is a Cuomo. All challenge going in. Akuma gets up. Gets out to the right-hand side. Little ball in there towards Vickers. Oh, they've equalised. What a start to the second half for Charlton. Ryan Vickers alone at Maidstone United last season with a deft touch at the near post. Fairly similar, in fact, to the Tunbridge goal. Cross from the right-hand side coming in from Akuma. And there was Vickers who got past Lyons Foster and gets the ball past Johnny Henley. It's 1-1. Nathan Wood on corner duty from both sides tonight for Tunbridge. Gets a decent ball in. And there's Tommy Fagg up there. Runs there towards Swift. Oh, long range effort. Well, anything could have happened there. Well saved by the keeper. In comes another corner. Towards the far post. It's Jamie Fielding. And it's through as far as Junior. It's 2 1. Jamie Fielding's header against the post. More or less hit Ruben Suarez Jr. Did he know much about it or did he deliberately head that in that direction? Yep, there was a bit of purpose there. And his performance has deserved a goal so far and he's got it. 2-1. Tunbridge just possessed Charlton in the midfield again. Here's Tommy Fagg. Trying to play that one to the right-hand side. Ruben Suarez Jr. again. Nice control from him. What can he do with this? Gets past his man. Gets the ball in. Tommy Fagg far post. Tommy Fagg scores. It's 3-1. He's playing up front for the last 20 minutes of this game, it looks like. And within minutes of going into that position, he acts like a traditional number nine and gives the goalkeeper no chance. Again, Ruben Suarez Jr. playing with his man, gets the ball across, and Tommy Fagg gets up the highest and heads it past the trialist keeper. 
Well, it's a really strong Tunbridge performance in this second half. A few substitutes on now in the last few minutes or so, but it doesn't seem to have affected the rhythm whatsoever. Here's Tommy Fagg, who's been on since the very start. Gets the ball out wide there towards Jamie Fielding. What can Fielding do with this one? Trying to beat three players, gets it between them. Nice ball from him to Wagstaff. Gets that back there towards Critchlow, and Critchlow, nice ball into the area, and trying to bring the ball away. Feels the handball, it's given. It's going to be a penalty. Well, Cuomo can't believe it. But he did look to have hit his hand. So a penalty. And Ruben Suarez Jr. said, yep, this one's for me. He wants his second goal of the game. So which way is this going? Keepers left, keepers right. What's he going to try? Not much of a run up. Ruben Suarez Jr. It's the Panenka and it's 4-1. <laughs> what cheek taking that penalty that way but he has his second and it's Tunbridge Angels 4 Charlton 1 and I make that two goals and two assists in the game for Ruben Suarez Jr he did touch his hand I'm afraid and in, here he goes with the penalty cool as you like keep a dice to his right and Ruben Suarez Jr plays through the middle it's a very convincing performance from Tunbridge against this young Charlton side but they've won the ball back inside their own half. It looks like they have they lost possession. The referee blows. Well, in fact, there's a little bit of disagreement there between the Charlton 12 and the Tunbridge 14, Joel Powell. And the referee is just going to have to sort this out. And hopefully that just a little bit of a word between the pair of them and, and, and that'll be it. Oh, <laughs> a little bit of a kick out there, wasn't there? I think in a league game that might have been a little bit different. But as it's a friendly referee dealing with it sensibly. Is there a fifth goal in it for Tunbridge? May well be Ruben Suarez Jr. Cropping up on the left-hand side this time. Can he get a ball in? Who's in the middle? Nobody yet. There's Tommy Fagg from distance. Oh, well saved. Comes out though to Wagstaff on the left-hand side. Well, they left Ruben a lot of space on the right-hand side. There's Tommy Fagg. Trying to play that one through. There's Hayden Velvick. Oh, it's a substitute. Great play by him. Oh, what great skill. Great perseverance. Gets the ball out there to Critchlow. Critchlow, can he get a cross in? Left foot ball in. Header Tommy Fagg near post. It's Tunbridge's fifth. And it's Tommy Fagg's second. Tunbridge five. Sean Athletic one. And with five minutes to go, it's a round. Two goals in the centre forward position for Tommy Fagg. So who knows what role he may play this season. In it goes. Bullet header. 5-1. Can't think of a weak performance in this Tunbridge side at all today. Every single player playing at their best. Wagstaff, ball in towards Hines. Hines, could have an opportunity. May have taken a deflection and goes wide, but it didn't. It's a goal kick. And that is the end of the game. What a night. What an atmosphere for a pre-season game. And if that doesn't get you excited for the season, I don't know what does. Two for Ruben. Two for Tommy. One for Joe Bochy. It's 5-1 Angels.